This is from Madeline Reed Lueck. Ants in the rainforest have been known to be attacked by a fungus which zombifies the ant and forces it to do unnatural fungus aid behavior. Is it possible for a fungus like this to attack human beings? Ooh. Uh, well, I don't know that we've actually seen a fungus that turned people into zombies, but we certainly see fungi that execute all kinds of clever activities to force the behavior of whatever they infect to facilitate spread of their spores. Absolutely. And, uh, so there'd be, there'd be macroscopic viral behavior. Yeah, right? I mean, that's what you, a virus you does. You might argue that's what athletes put in a gym is. Absolutely. Uh, or the, uh, or the uh, particular uh, fungus that causes you to uh, scratch your genitals. Oh, now you're sounding like um, Book of Mormon. There's a particular <laughs> passage repeatedly <laughs> in that. I can't say on the radio. <laughs> that's if you don't bathe, Chuck. Oh. Okay. Just FYI. Mm -hmm. But okay, so, and, and, and fungi, since they taste good, they have a way to get into all of our bodies. Mm. Not all fungi taste good, but there are <laughs> those that do. Mm -hmm. Especially certainly. shiitake. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, they are, we are surrounded by spores that are bacterial spores, fungal spores. Um, they drift in the air, and in some cases, they luck out and land in a proper location in your personal ecology. To cause disease. Nice. So that, that's where it is. So there we have it. So basically, uh, the answer is yes, one day you will be a zombie made from a fungus. <laughs> <laughs> There's sure. your answer, Madeline. <laughs> now that you put it that way. <laughs>